welcome to our spring music recital, May 1st, 2022. Look at all these wonderful people that we have here to come support all of the young musicians who worked so hard over this last year. We're going to have, I think, a couple hours, maybe even better, of some awesome music that all these young folks will share. Welcome everyone to our joint Spring Music Beagle Music Studio recital. It's wonderful to see all of you. Thank you so much for taking the afternoon to come out and support all these wonderful young musicians who have worked so hard over the last eight months or so. Um, this is Amberlynn and I'm Brooklyn and uh, we're just very glad that you're all here. A uh, big thank you and encouragement um, to all of the students in their participation, the certain ones that particip participated in the uh, Grand Prairie Music Festival this year came out with shining colors, so we are extremely excited for them. Um, why don't we give everyone a big hand for that? And uh, also, I want to recognize our accompanists for the day. There are many uh, piano accompanists as well as we have boron drum, we have the accordion, what else do we have, uh, bass, uh, we have a whole bunch of accompanists and like the uh, violin adjudicator in festival this year pointed out, um, our, the accompanists that are on stage with us are our best friends. We would be very lost without them, especially as violinists and vocalists. So a big thank you to our accompanists. <laughs> I'm Brianne and this is Lene as well um, and we also want to give a big thank you to Bob and Lynette Beagle, that's our, our parents, for the use of this amazing venue for our, our recital um, as well as the people who have contributed um, the electric pianos. You'll see information on the back there um, of your programs for who we would love to thank. There are many other people as well, we obviously can't put it all in there but thank you as well to everybody who has come. Um, students specifically, between performances, please make sure that you are right ready, like in that corner or this corner, um, waiting there ready while the person before you is performing so that we can keep everything moving at a very um, good pace. Um, yeah, that, that, yeah, please, if you need to use the washrooms, that's fine. If you could try and not do so during the performance, that would be nice. So if, if you need to move, move out of the doors when the people are clapping. Um, one other big thank you, big thank you to Charles. He is taking care of our sound system today. That is a huge job. He's been setting up all morning for this. So thank you so much, Charles. Okay, and just a few uh, housekeeping things. Bathrooms, if anyone is needing them, there is one um, out this door and just around the corner of the shop you'll see a brown door and you can go in there and there's a little map there of where the washroom is and there's also another one if you go to the front of the house up the deck and then in through that door you'll see it on the right um, and then also if everyone who is here would kindly sign our guest book that we have located on this side of the shop that would be wonderful and also please uh, put all of your phones onto uh, airplane mode so that they don't disrupt a performance. Thank you. And by all means, feel free to film your children or your siblings as they're performing. And just a quick question, does anyone here um, desire to not be on YouTube? Please raise your hand if you would not like to be on YouTube because some of, these, some of this footage, pictures might end up on our YouTube channel. <laughs> so, okay. <laughs> Good. Thank you, and we yes. hope you enjoy. And violinists, please come up to your spot. The song that we will launch the program off with is Ein Klein Nacht Musik. It means a little night music in German, which a lot of you probably already know. Um, so yeah, and then following that is a Celtic piece called 
Cuckoo's nest.
Cuba by Nathaniel Dett. Nathaniel Dett was born in Niagara Falls, Ontario, Canada. During his lifetime, he was a leading black composer. The Juba dance is an African-American style of dance that involves stomping as well as slapping and patting the arms, legs, chest and cheeks. The Juba dance was originally brought by Congo slaves to Charlton, South Carolina. It became an African-American plantation dance that was performed by slaves during their gatherings when no rhythm instruments were allowed due to fear of secret codes hidden in the dark. intermission the teachers it's their turn to do some solos so make sure you're back for that in 15 minutes better yet 10 minutes make sure that we can start on time and parents please make sure that your children are with you at all times because there's open water south of the house a big dugout please keep your children with you okay we'll see you back in 10 15 minutes Look at all these vehicles. I cannot believe how many people are here. All oh, these people, all the children. That's awesome. You gotta count these vehicles. I can't believe how many there are. They're everywhere. Everywhere. And the whole front of the shop is full. Awesome. All right, welcome back again, everyone. Renee and I will open this next section with a German song called Das Fischermädchen by Franz Schubert. Thank you. 
afternoon. Thank you so much for staying and thank you so much for all the music, all of the hard work, and we will have a feast at the end. Okay, we're done. No, we've got a half an hour yet. <laughs> Hungry mouths being satisfied with good food. 